Yo, right, everybody, it's time for us to return to the world of Cowboys from Hell. Is that a Pantera reference, Falcon? You know, it could be. You know what? Let's just say that in high school, I took a little bit of an affinity towards the heavy metal and the thrash metal, and, you know, I might have dabbled in some of that. But that's neither here nor there. We're here checking out the sequel to Hard West. Titled Hard West 2, I mean, big shocker there, it's a sequel. Just add a, a 2 to it, it's perfectly fine. Now what's crazy about this, I didn't even know it was this much time in between. But I know I covered Hard West in the channel, so I looked up my videos on it. 2015! 2015! Do you understand? That was like a lifetime ago for me. I was still a young man in 2015. Any idiot with a gun can rob a bank. Robbing a train? Now that's a real feat. So I got this tip from a guy about a train full of federal gold. Runs by a night, minimal crew. Folks call it the ghost train. Some even believe it's haunted. Me? I think it's a pretty good cover. So I've rustled up a posse to go after it. Flynn. Been on the green side, but probably the smartest of us all. Clearly, I don't keep her around for her fists, but she's got darker talents. The kind that don't bear dwelling on much. Laughing Deer. Don't mind the name. Nothing funny about this one. An exile, even among his own tribe. What he did, I do not know. But I do know what he does, and what he does ain't pretty. Then there's Clive. Kestrel Colt, as the press calls him. Fastest gun in the West, they say, <laughs> and he don't argue none. He's my protege and my best friend. Me, I'm Jim Carter, gunslinger, outlaw, first-rate gambler at your service, and very soon, a filthy rich man. They barely have any security. No passengers, too. I don't like this. Let's call it off. Go, go, go. Whoever boards the train first gets an extra cut. All right. I like it. Short little introduction and right into the gameplay. I've played too many games recently where it's like, hey, let's have this, you know, movie linked intro and then follow it up with like a two hour tutorial. So this is just like right into it, it's perfect. So here we'll basically do the tutorial, which is very quick by the way. But it basically transitions right into gameplay and into the very first mission, so skipping it would be kind of silly. So we'll get through it really quickly. It basically kind of teaches you the new things involved with the game. So if you play with the first one, you might be curious about what's been added now. So let's uh, just follow the I'd quick stuff it wants me to do. Close. Action points, every character has three. Get him off of that horse. Laughing Deer, I like a lot. He's basically melee focused. But there is this awesome new system they added, which I absolutely love. I feel like it basically forces you, or doesn't force you, but at least it rewards you for playing aggressive. Damn, I'm good. Who's next? And this is the uh, this is the addition. I'm pretty sure this wasn't in Hard West 1. I have a terrible memory, you guys don't know. But I remember trick shots from Hardwiz 1, which are in 2, which is great. I don't remember Bravado, and I feel this is a new one that they are added. Essentially, every single time you kill somebody with a character, your action points get restored again, immediately on the spot. So it forces you to play aggressive, like it rewards you, like, you know, oh, you, instead of, you know, turtling up half cover, full cover for like the entirety of the map and you're kind of waiting it out. If you're aggressive, you'll get rewarded. Let's go into our trick shot. Right now, we're looking at a 50% chance to hit, right? The half cover grants on that 50% debuff towards our aim. But if we activate luck, which basically, every, I believe every time you take a hit or you miss a shot, your luck increases. So it's a cool little feature as well. That basically bypasses his half cover, as you can see. And now we have a 100% chance to hit. So. Fastest gun in the West. Uh, Jim Carter. Oh, man. I mean. I'm not sure if I can hit this one. We'll find out. Get in the upper hand. And of course, the bravado does kick in. But, not a good chance to hit this dude. I suppose what I could do is move him. 
switch over to the weapon, handgun, and then take him out with that. He's only got 5 HP, so it should be fine. That is, as long as we stick to just one. All right, that would be all one. Right. Switch gun out. Easy. Good. Right. And again, Bravado will once again kick in. You see, I, I absolutely love it. It just forces you to play aggressive, and it rewards you for it. Uh, unfortunately, though, oh, we could probably come down to here, but I don't see a good shot, to be honest. So I'm gonna just skip on him. And let's just have, uh, I guess Cole finish this off for us at this point. Yeah, that's a good spot for him. You don't need luck for this one, my friend. There we go. Two riflemen. And a conveniently placed item that we could ricochet some shots off right there, so... I like that. That'll give us a bravado as well. Make sure he goes down. Going in! Guns blazing! Now, we don't have any more luck now because that wasn't a shot towards us, nor did we miss, so... That didn't give us any extra luck. So this time we are going to be gambling with our 75% chance to hit. It's a good chance though, right? Let's dance. Hold the dice, gentlemen. Thank you for the um, chance to not miss at 98 possibility chance to hit. Little XCOM right there. A tunnel? There were no tunnels here on the map. Someone get a light! I can't see anything. No, wait. Can you hear that? What the hell is happening? What is this? Stay calm. Where the hell are we? I said stay calm, goddammit. Oh, it's about to get spooked. And this is where our horror element to the Wild Wild West game that hard- Ah, where are you going, Doug? <laughs> I, I absolutely hate games that have, like, you know, edge scrolling. Hate it. I think we're going Jim Carter. So let's see here. Bounce off of you. Do this. Won't be enough for the kill. It's so a 75% chance to hit two, but I like it. I like it. Then we can follow up with, um, Laughing Deer afterwards is what I'm hoping. Love it. All right. Now, unfortunately, that also means that now we, for you, we can't shoot anymore. We just have to either hunker down or move. We'll probably move. I hear my name. Let me get Laughing Deer back into this. It's my boy, boy. Do some work. <laughs> Do some work, Laughing Deer. So that's good there. Before I send him to follow up, let's see about getting a couple more damage up there first. So now let's move it over to... Oh, no, no, go back. Looking for trouble? Yeah. I hear my name. Coulter, Coulter, Coulter. I don't think... No, you, you should not be able to. So let's move you here for sure is what I'm thinking, and then we'll try to ricochet off of that. Stand back! And now... Laughing Deer go in there, get his kill. The problem is we won't have enough for this dude unless we do a little bit of just tiny amount of damage. So this is where I would need Flynn to hook me up. Shotgun ain't gonna do it here for us. I, I guess we'll go with the little small container and see if we can ricochet off of that. It's a bit of a gamble, but... Oh! Oh, let's go. She doesn't have any luck, so 75% chance it'll be if she hits. Laughing Deer has this for us. My disappointment is immeasurable. And my day is ruined. Go and be the MVP you would have otherwise been. <laughs> if not for Flynn. Die! One and only. Carter can't do much, but at this point... Nah, just stay there. At least he got some protection back there. Hunker down, I guess, if you even have to. So we're going to take damage here because of that one freaking miss. Who's it going to be? Ah, oh, not my boy laughing. Dear. I need him at full HP so we could do some damage for us going forward. Alright. 
Um, I guess we might as well just finish it up at this point, right? Yeah. I will. That's how things would have gone down. What's up now? Get to the train engine. All right, so we're ready to breach here. Let's get in there, I guess, with laughing near first. Right. There's a bunch of um, crazy stuff happening here, by the way. Ah, Bodies all over the place. Guests. Finally here. Hmm. Okay. Got a little boss fight, huh? Now, Mammon? I feel like that's a name I should be familiar with. No, I, I know I've heard that name before. Okay. And he's got, got two boys with him as well. Here we go. One. So we could come up here and then take a shot from here. Let's do that. <laughs> Presumably take a shot from here. Yeah, we do have one over there. We can even shoot him and the hell spawn as well. 75% chance to hit, huh? Let's enable that luck. I don't trust I you after your 75% miss. Perfect. And that would technically, I just want to see if we could just set ourselves point. up with Laughing Deer to do a rush. Yeah, it's fine. It's going to take up all three, but the one shot that we'll do, we'll kill him. And then we could follow up this guy if somebody just damages his health spawn. Then we can just focus on yeah. the boss afterwards. So, you could even say if I want to play it a little bit. Well, let's do Kestrel Cold first. Uh, one, one, one. I'm just looking for a oneer here first. That's going to be a oneer. And with luck enabled, you should be able to do your thing here. Take it. On it. So that's gonna set up a laughing deer for us. That's gonna put laughing deer in a you know precarious situation afterwards, because the boss will be right next to him, but at least two boys down. I think we do it. So let's uh Well, let's let's move Jim Carter here close first and see if we can maybe hammer in a shot there. We'll do. This is risky because we got no 50% chance to hit. He's got no luck either. No luck. Uh, well, we could apparently bounce it off of the invalid angle. Yeah, because I'm shooting from this side. The, the bullet won't go. I mean, can I bounce it off of this and this? Oh, my God, he can. <laughs> I mean, our chance to hit doesn't even go higher. But check it out. If he hits at 50% by ricocheting twice, I mean, come on, let's go, right? Let's go. Let's dance. Oh my god, he missed. But it would have been so good. It would have been so good. All right. Laughing deer, take us home, baby. Oh, uh. Show these scrubs how it's done. A good day to die. Done and done. <laughs> Look at my boy go. And then we got, you know, you bring him up to 24. Or I could make him retreat, sure, and, um, you know, maybe get into coverage. But let's play a little bit aggressively. Let's smack this dude down a little bit. Oh, oh you got me. What? Oh, but what is this? The villain returns from the grave. <laughs> oh, cute. Guess which one of us is real, or I'll make you people squeal. My boy's got rhymes too, uh, he's over here dropping some lines on us. Alright. Well, you know what? I can't imagine that it'll have me do 30 damage to each one to find out which one's real. So it'll probably just disappear per, right? And I wonder if making it disappear will also just restore Laughing Deer's uh, bravado. Because if so, we can just basically go with Laughing Deer down the line and find out what the real one is. Again, the MVP, what can I tell you? It ain't him, boys. That's not me. Hawa. A good day to die. Not your day. Have I told you how much you love this bravado system and laughing deer? <laughs> it, it's so good. I it's will. so freaking good. Try another one. Alright. Three left, huh? Well, I like it because, you know, wherever you show up, you're going to be right close to us, so we'll be able to just... Pardon the phrase, gangbang them, you're pretty good. N not in that way. I mean, like, you know, with guns, gangbang them, you know? 
That's that's obviously what I meant. What you think I meant? Die! Sickle. Found him. Oh wait, the other dudes remain. Hmm. Well, it's fine. Wicked essentially is bladding with the other boys to bravado off of them. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, laughing here's the only one who can. Wait, what? You had a VP. Oh. Oh. Oh, cool, Batman. All right. Well, might as well. <laughs> we about to get bladded ourselves, boys. Oh, he missed. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> he was right there. What's he doing? Die! Oh. He's summoned. Oh, thankfully they're all missing with their terrible shots. Die! This one was fake. <laughs> Have I told you how much of an MVP um this laughing deer dude is? Because he's freaking amazing. Die! This will bring it down to at least 18. <laughs> Now, do we have enough firepower left to do 18? I doubt it. But he's definitely set up there just for the finish. Actually, 50. Set me loose. Let's do this. Flynn, Flynn, Flynn. Mmm. You do have some luck. Can you actually get a shot up from here without missing? Because, you know, with you, I, I just never know with you, you know? 100% chance to hit. I'll take that one. I'll try. You'll try and you actually will because you can't miss with that buff that I just gave you. I'm gonna keep you there. I'm gonna keep you right over there. Castro. What about you, playboy? What you got for me? 100? I mean, you have that um, double shot as well possibility, so you know, you never know. You could probably luck out. Dibs! Oh, had we double shot him, that would have been it. That would have been it. Well, might as well hunker. Is he summoning again? Oh, he's summoning again. And then he's um, taking a shotgun right into Laughing Deer's belly. What what's an absolute scum. Well, I'll tell you what, what's the play? I think the play is we give Laughing Deer his due and take this home for us because he's basically dead. That's bravado. What the hell? Oh, don't be so surprised, Mr. Carter. I am a devil after all. Who do you think you are? The name's Mammon. Thanks for asking. I really have guests here. There's just no one fresh to play with. You like games, Mammon? Then how about a hand of poker? I win, you let us go and throw something in for our trouble. We lose? Well, it's your call. So greedy, I love it. I'll tell you what. How about I toss in the ghost engine? Just imagine all this power. It can make your wildest dreams come true. Win, and I give it to you. Lose, and your souls are mine. You want our souls? Yeah, sure. Knock yourself out. Our souls, Jin? What the hell? Shall I deal? We're using my deck. <laughs> Remember, Mr. Carter. One deal. High hand wins. Are you ready? Let's get to it, then. Yes, that's right! Read them and weep, devil! If you think that will make a difference. <laughs> and the winner takes all! <laughs> you really think you could out-cheat me? 
five of a kind. No, 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 what? no. This is some no. kind of a trick. I don't even have a Joker in my deck. Now it's time to cack in those chips. <laughs> Hell up, Jin! Come on! Open your eyes! Gee, I never would have seen that happening. We, we can't out-cheat a devil at a hand of cards? No, get out of here. That said, we're apparently now in the middle of nowhere. What really happened, who knows? But we're out of time, so I'm going to wrap it up here. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Um, if you'd like to see a bit more, you know what to do. Let me know in the comments. If you're leaving a thumbs up, maybe we'll come back and do a bit more. It's only the beta. It's not a complete game just yet, but uh, we can actually see what the overworld gameplay would be like and see where it goes from here otherwise the actual combat mechanics really really fun hope you guys enjoyed i'll catch you next time